Hello and welcome. Our topic for the day is identifying the common difference. To understand the concept, let's do some questions. The first one says, solve, given the sequence, identify the common difference. And we are given the sequence over here, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, 15. Before we go on to solve the question, let's understand how to find the common difference. It says to find the common difference, we have to subtract a pair of terms. That is, we pick up a pair of terms from the given sequence. It doesn't matter which pair we pick as long as they are right next to each other. So that means we have to pick two terms which are just besides each other. So let's try and pick up 9 and 11. And we have to subtract. That is nine, 11 minus 9 which is equals to 2. Now this is the common difference. Let's see if it is. So let's write the first number, 5. For this we add 2 now. So we get the next term that is 7. That's correct. We plus 2. We get the next term 9. We add another 2. We get 11. We add another 2. We get 13. When we add 2 to 13 we get 15. So we see that the sequence that is generated matches with the given one. So that means the common difference 2 is the correct answer, which is option D. Let's try the next one. Solve. Given the sequence, identify the common difference 3, 11, 19, 17, 27, 35 and 43. So let's pick up the first and the second term. So we have 11 minus 3 to find out the common difference. 11 minus 3 is 8. So that means 8 is the common difference. Let's see real quick. 3 first term, we add 8 to it, we get 11. 11, we add 8, we get 19. 19, we add 8, we get 27. So we are getting the same sequence as that was given to us. That is, 8 is the common difference, which is option A. Let's try the next question. Given the sequence, identify the common difference. So we give negative 3, negative 7, negative 11, negative 15, negative 19 and negative 23. Let's take these two terms this time. So we have negative 19 minus negative 15. So negative 19. Negative times negative is a positive. Now one negative number, one positive number. So we subtract 19 minus 15 is 4. Keep the sign of the bigger number that is negative 4. So negative 4 is the common difference. Let's see whether this is correct or not. We write the first term negative 3. So negative 3 plus negative 4 to get the next term which is equals to negative 3 minus 4 which is equals to negative 7 so we write negative 7 now negative 7 plus negative 4 this is equals to negative 7 minus 4 which is equal to negative 11 again correct now we see our terms are matching with the sequence given to us that means negative 4 is a common difference is the correct answer which can be seen in option A. I hope identifying the common difference is easy now. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.